It was a beautiful gray day and now the sun is shining through. There's a space between the clouds. <laughs> it is Sunday and I remembered that I want to go to Goodwill on Sundays because this is when they have certain items, a certain color tag. It used to be 50% off. I don't know if it's 30% off now. I think I remember seeing that sign, but anyway, I'll let you know. I'm just going to walk around. I need to start doing that because I never know when I might find something in the clothing that I might like and or that I might be able to alter. That, that would be super cool if I could do some videos of altering clothes. Um, like if I find something that would happen to be too big, take it down or find something that's not spectacular, like not a really good print, but that fits me the way I want, I could deconstruct that, take it apart, and use it as a pattern. So it's almost like going on a treasure hunt for me, and I kind of like that. And then I always look at the shoes, because if I see some shoes that I like but are not like really practical, I might wear them only once in a while. I don't care if I pay only five bucks for them. You know what I mean? It's, it's, it's just all exciting that I have shopping minded brain lately. So let's go in. I'm going to take you with me in case I want to show you something. And then I have to run to Walmart for coffee um, uh, in my instant and uh, milk because I do still put a little bit of milk in my coffee. What I do is I put um, a little bit of milk in my cup and two tablespoons of butter. So a quarter stick of butter. And I heat that in the microwave as the water is boiling on my stovetop because that's how, that's how I make coffee. And then, um, so I have butter in my coffee, just a little bit of coffee. And then I'm cutting back on even how much coffee I put in my cup. I used to do like a heaping tablespoon full and now I'm down to like half of that. And, but I still want coffee and I still buy milk. And then what's the other thing? I have a list. Milk, coffee. Oh, and I have to get butter. Okay, so I'm going to do that. I'm sure I will talk to you after Goodwill and then maybe after Walmart. It's all good. I'm excited. I'm excited for this Sunday where I can go shopping. Now I know why there's no one here and I had the whole parking lot to myself. <laughs> Goodwill doesn't open until noon and it was only 11 when I started talking to you. So I have an hour to kill. What I did is I killed 15 minutes in Dollar Tree and all I ended up getting was a pack of razors like that. And so I, um, I'm going to go to Walmart and pick up my couple of things, but then there's no way I'm spending 45 minutes in there. Uh, I think I'll go home, put those few things away, maybe do something while I'm at home, and then we'll come back out. That was good. I went home, put my stuff away. I didn't separate and freeze my, my beef yet. I decided to pick up some thin steaks, uh, thinly sliced sirloin steak and um, some cubed steaks. And I freeze those like two per pack or whatever and I have that with ground beef. So yums, yum yums. And um, and I was able to edit the beginning of this video and now I'm back to Goodwill and it's obviously open because the parking lot is filled. It only opens at noon on Sundays. I think the other days of the week, I don't know if it was nine or 10. I'm not likely to ever be here that early. Sundays, I hope I can do this every Sunday or at least every other Sunday. So let's go in, see if I can find anything. We have a temporary change of plans. I walked into Goodwill. I always look at the shelving type stuff to see if there's ever anything and I found like the plastic shelving. Uh, four big shelves. Dirty. I can clean that up. Uh, only 13 bucks and it comes apart. And I also got a text from Skylar begging for a ride right now to her friend's house. So I told her I'm going to put the shelving in my car. I'm gonna go pick her up, bring her to her friends, and then I'm coming back to Goodwill. But let me show you. See, there's four units. I just took them apart and have them stacked like that. 
this is going to free up floor space for me. I can put whatever bolts I have left on there and the boxes that I get with like 100 fat quarters, I still have some of those boxes. And then I have to get myself to throw away all the empty boxes that I have. It's so heartbreaking. Anyway, somebody is about to back into me. So let me try to put this in the car. You have no idea how excited I am. And yes, those legs can come off, but they are practically glued in. They were trying to help me in Goodwill, and I was like, no, I, there's no way. So I just said, leave them on, I'll make it work, and I did. Of course, if I couldn't have fit it all, I would have just had them hold the other pieces until I came back. I am finally back at Goodwill. Picked Skylar up, took her to her friends. It's about a half hour round trip. And I just came back here. I didn't stop. I'm not bringing that shelving stuff in until probably tomorrow. Wash everything and then rearrange stuff. I'm going to like doing that. There's still 50% off on Sundays. Today I have to look for the green tags. And I used to look at the actual paper tag. And they have different colors like M might be all reds. And so I'd be like, okay, it's red tag day but I have to only buy mediums. Uh, no, it's the little plastic thing that the tag hangs on. It's the color of that that we have to look at. So I'm glad to know that. 50% off, something with a green tag. And I don't care if I walk out of there empty handed because I got this shelving unit. So I am good, so excited. This is why I have to come to Goodwill more often. And uh, let's go look at some clothes. I did quite a bit of recording in there and then I realized that I can't show you any of it because they play a station that plays the best music, but I remember that I get a copyright. It's not a strike. It's not like I'd be in trouble, but I would not be able to monetize this video. So I can't show you, you know, the stuff that I was showing you inside. And the fucking fix came on. One thing leads to another, and I wanted to scream. I know Derek and I talked about it in one of the videos where we're together on his channel. How he remembers, and he even texted because I told him, oh my god, the fix. I'm like, you have to play that song as a cover. I don't care which guitar you use. I, I need that in my life. <laughs> he says, I remember you always screaming to that song. He says, I think it was in the Supra, the Toyota Supra that I had for a while. Yes, I screamed every time. Every time I'd hear that song, but I could not scream in goodwill, and I just could not believe it. So, I'm hot. Let me put some AC on. You know, I often record customer service songs, and one time when I was on hold, there was some music playing that I happened to record, and because uh, I had my phone on speaker, I was just waiting to be off hold, and so there was music, and I got a copyright notice on that, but I didn't care. That's just a private video that is just for my sake. But yeah, so it's getting more and more um, tricky to have any background music for any length of time. I mean, I, it can be like over five seconds and YouTube will pick it up. Um, they're supposed to be doing something different now with their uh, music sometime this year. I'm not even gonna bother to explain it to you. I have no first-hand experience with it, but it's going to be something different with the rules of music. So it will make it harder and harder to um, record in stores that have any kind of music. All right, let's let's uh, let me show you what I did get. I came this close to getting a pair of black suede boots, ankle boots, and I really loved them. They were my size. They felt a little too loose, but I said I could wear some thicker socks, but I could get away with it. The thing is, is they were $8, and I even hated to spend $8 on something I wasn't sure of. But she said, um, oh, and I didn't know, it wasn't a green tag. But yeah, the, the shoes, they're all tagged different colors. So if it would have been a green tag sticker on the shoe, I would have got them for half price. I think I would have purchased them at that point. But I'm so big on I do not want to be gathering stuff unless I am 100% sure that I will wear them. Uh, and she said on the 16th of January, this is 2023, uh, everything in the store is 40% off, so I better fucking shop on that day. And if those boots are still there, 
I'll probably pick them up at that point. I'm, I'm not thrilled with what I got here. Uh, again, it, it's, but it was, it was only three dollars. So, but again, it's not the money, it's that I, oh, she put a thing in there, reminding me. 40% off. I will not forget. Uh, it's just, again, I just don't want stuff that I end up never using. I got this skirt for the fabric. And I just loved the print. Hippie tie-dye. I'm very much into the hippie look. Very much. I can make a shirt out of that. There's more than enough fabric here. However, it, you know, it's, it's just, it, it is 100% cotton, but it doesn't stretch. I don't like blouses. I like stretchy, stretchy everything. But with the fabric, I thought, Maybe I could even make myself some kind of even just a like a sleeveless cover up for when I go to the pool that I could just uh, have open in the front and a little bit long and then you know I don't know I'll think of something I better because I'm going to be really pissed if in a year from now this is still somewhere in my apartment not not used so I'm going to look at some different designs of shirts maybe I could have a, a shirt made out of it I don't know but I I couldn't I couldn't resist and that's all I could get the thing that sucks about Goodwill is they don't have tags for like uh, 2x 3x they have large and then the tag that hangs uh, the biggest they have is extra large so you have to look at the extra large because sometimes that clothing is a 2x or a 3x 4x and they don't have a whole lot of um, big shirts because I think once a woman who is that size has a shirt that fits, you, you hang on to it for the rest of your life. <laughs> they don't end up in goodwill. But uh, like I said, skirts are an option if I feel like making my own tops. Dresses are an option because I can always just cut the dress. If it's something loose and flowy, I can just cut the bottom and now I have a, a shirt long sleeves i look at those because i can easily chop off sleeves i've, I've been chopping off sleeves my entire life <laughs> so been a good day it's getting late it is very late it is two o'clock i started this day at 11 a.m and it's 2 p.m now so i'm going to go home finish uh editing this which suddenly got much easier because i have to cut out all of goodwill and i have to uh derek did not commit to learning one thing leads to another uh, so I have to work on that. <laughs> the fix. I just love that song. Alright you guys, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!